you guys are watching aim to shame and we are back with another video 160 subscribers now I love you all and of course no homo unless you're in no 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 homo guys but anyway let's get started in this video gun game in the background we got we moved away from one of the chamber trying to get you some more gameplay if i can it may still be a party game but you know it's different to one of the chamber which is a start but let's get started with today's topic and today's topic is, of course, you've seen the title, I didn't mean to say it, but I will say it anyway. Three sayings I hate hearing at school. Let's get straight into this, no, no shabalagging around. Shabalagging, I don't think that's a word, but we're going we're to use it, we're going to use it in the commentary. Anyway, saying number one, can I have some of that? Usually this is said when you have like a packet of Harry Bows or whatever, you've got some sweets and someone asks for it. And if someone asks for it loud enough, then everyone can hear that in that group, and everyone there will turn around and stare at that food. Because you know, you know, once one person asks for it, and if you give it to them, you got to give it to everyone. That's the rules, guys. I don't know who makes the rules, but that's the rules. If you give it to one person, you got to give it to everyone. So, best way to do it is to be discreet about it. Don't tell anyone. Or if you're the person who spotted the Yasm, what you should say is, "Give me two of the sweets, and I won't tell anyone." There you are. You both got a good deal there, so that's that's my little tip to you guys. So people that ask for stuff and just beg. I mean, there's so many scavenger pro people around school just begging for food. As soon as you get it out, bang them all over you. Make sure you say no, guys. Don't give out your food. You know they don't deserve it. You're better than them. If you're a subscriber to me, then don't give out any of your food. You do, everyone, everyone is subscribed to me. You make sure you eat all the food you can, guys. But anyway, let's move on to saying number two. It's plain and simple. You have homework. That's no, I'm sorry, I do not have homework, there's no way I'm doing homework. I mean, you just spent a full day of school and then making you do more work at home. Well, that's not happening, guys, I'm sorry, I'm going to spend my free time playing one in the chamber, playing a bit of gun game, you know, playing a bit of FIFA, going on Twitter and that, watching some videos, that's what I'm going to be spending my time doing. No way am I doing a stupid maths question or whatever. No, no way that's happening, guys. So that's my most annoying saying, number two. Saying number three is a bit, some of you might not have heard this at all, but one of the most annoying things is, because I've had my last exam today, it's when people walk out of the exam and they're just like, that exam was easy. <laughs> that exam was easy. You cocky git. <laughs> I hope they fail, guys. Everyone that says that, you deserve to fail. I hope you get a big fat you. And uh, if, you, if you've never done an exam, guys, you means like fail. That's the worst you can get. So make sure, I hope all of them get a you. Just can't stand these people, they're so cocky, and they know there's going to be people around them that struggled in that exam. Doesn't stop them, they're going to shout it as loud as they can, making sure everyone knows that they're good at that subject. Well, I hope you messed up on the last question or whatever, guys. Well, I hope you messed up on every question. Hate this, guys. Can't stand them. But anyway, this is the end of the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll be putting a lot more effort in now, as all my exams are now done. But anyway, thanks for watching Aim to Shame. Twitter will be in the description below.